Hi, it's James Mackay here. What I'm going to do today is to show you how to download embedded videos. This is something people ask me for help with all the time. So um, I'll explain this the problem first and then I'll show you how to do it. So this is an embedded video. If you right click on this, it comes up with all this strange stuff where you might be expecting save video, but it doesn't work like that. So um, this is the video that we want to download. We can't right click save as, we can't come up to file save as or anything like that. So, the first thing you've got to do is be using Chrome for your browser. Then you come over to this little uh, menu option box here. You come down to More Tools, Developer Tools. You just click on that. This is the first step. That brings up all of this geeky code on the right hand side. You don't have to worry about that. You don't have to edit it. So just don't freak out at this point. You come up to the top left corner of the code section, you hit the select an element in the page to inspect it, also known as a magnifying glass, just like that, goes blue. Then you come back over to your video page and as you highlight different things here, um, what's going to happen is it pops up on the in the code. So we come down to our video and we click on that and watch the code and it highlights this video in the code. But what we want is to find the URL because all videos have their own unique uh, URL. So that's not really the right thing for us. There's no www or HTTP or anything like that. Although here we go here, we've got this here, but that's a .gif and a .gif is a picture. So we just keep scrolling up the page. And then here's a URL because it's got a, uh, to start with, it's underline, 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 underline show and shows us it's a, it's a link, not a www, it's not a .com, but that is a URL. So fast.wistia.net, blah, blah, blah. And in a URL up to the question mark is the URL. After that, doesn't count. So the video foam equals true isn't relevant. Now, this is, as you can see, I can't edit this. So I can't copy it, I can't paste in there. We need to right click and we go to edit as HTML. So that's step three, and the URL starts after as you know HTTP colon slash slash. So these are the slash slashes. It's just a different sort of URL, and we come up here. We highlight the whole lot up to the question mark like that. Then we right click and copy. We come up to here. We open a new tab, and we literally just paste and go, and that's going to paste in our URL and that starts to load our video. Ta-da! What we've done now is isolated the video onto the page and got rid of the rest of the page. Now, the next step, you come up to View, go down to Developer, View Source. So View, Developer, View Source, and that brings up the source code only of the video, so it's broken it down to the next level. And then what we're doing is looking for a video file. And if you save a video file, it's going to be a .mov, .avi, or .mp4. So here is a .mp4. We click on that. That should bring up a video file. There Hi, it is. I'm James Whoops. And that's me being loud. There's our video. So what we've done there is taken it from a URL up to a file name. That's our very long convoluted file name then we can right click on this because it's not a web page per se, it's an actual video file and we can save video as. Call it uh, whatever we want, we'll call it James and save it to the desktop and boom, you're done. And that is how you save an embedded video.